I'm be honest with you. Yeah, man, I look at life like a video game. And I feel like I'm at that certain part where I froze last time. And I froze two other times. And to me, I'm tired of freezing. I want to see what's on the other side. I want to, I know I have the spiritual power to finish it this time. And I want to finish it because I'm just curious about spirituality. I'm curious to see what's on that other side that I didn't get to last time. What's on that level, what's on that next level that I didn't reach. And I'm just curious to see where spirit is going to push me once I push beyond that level or beyond that level I kept losing it like a video game. I just want to see what's next, what's the next step once I get past that level, once I do what I'm supposed to do, what's on that other side, what's the next level to the spiritual game, what's the next level to what spirit has for me, what's the next spiritual gift, what's the next spiritual journey, what's the next spiritual thing that I have to go through now that I've made it past the level that so-called held me back. The level that the devil thought I couldn't make it past. The level that the devil thought had power over me. The level that the devil thought I would never be strong enough to make it past. Now that I know what I need to know and I know I have my spiritual strength and I set my spiritual intention and I believe in my spiritual powers, I want to see what was I missing. That's That was my whole point in coming back. I didn't come back to freeze at the same level. I came back to finish the job and see what's the next spiritual intention thing that I can set, what's the next energy, what's the next thing that I own power over. Now that I've beaten my past thing that used to hold me back and I know I have the strength to make it through and I know I have the wisdom to make it through and I know I have the power to make it through. I just want to see what's next. And I'm more excited and curious than I am nervous or afraid. I just want to see what's the next level. And I want to keep growing spiritually more than anything else because I didn't come back to be sat down and be told, oh, you're just going to make it to the same level and you're going to do the same thing. No, I want to see what I've been missing. I want to see... What what did I come back for? What did what did I miss? What spiritual gift did I miss out on? What thing am I missing? And what what how my spiritual gift is gonna grow now that I've made it past it? How is my spiritual gift gonna grow now that I'm to the next level? What did I exactly miss out on? How stronger can I get? How much more spiritual gifts can I gain? How much more knowledge can I gain spiritually? I'm just curious to see what what's next and let the new version of myself out. The version of myself that isn't afraid of anything. The version of myself that isn't afraid to speak his mind or speak his intention. The version of myself that really speaks about what he means and speaks from his heart and never held back. Now that I'm back to that version of myself, I'm just curious to see that now that I'm speaking with that confidence and that intention, I want to see what I'm meant to be in life because I felt like that was always one of the things that held me back. I always was afraid to tell people the truth or I always sentimentally tried to save people feeling. Now that I'm not doing that, and I'm growing into the truest version of myself. I want to see what it earns me. I'm curious to see what other things in life I'm going to unlock spiritually, mentally, and emotionally, and just life-wise. What other rewards do I unlock? Because I look at it like a video game, and I just want to see what that next level is like, spiritually, mentally, and emotionally. And I want everybody else to be that curious. Whatever used to hold you back in your past life, you're past it. You have to tell yourself that and you have to believe it in your heart, mind, body, and spirit. And just be excited to see what's next. 
tell yourself you already made it over it because you have. Just by coming back and learning your spiritual gift and putting yourself through this and going through it and believing in yourself, you know you're stronger than you used to be. You know you're greater than you used to be. You know you're better than you used to be. And for all of us, I'm just curious to see what's next. I want to see what all of us can achieve, what all of us can accomplish, what all of us can do as a unit now that we made it past our past hurdles. And I'm just looking forward to keeping spiritually growing, mentally, emotionally, and spiritually. I want to see what type of physical life, what type of spiritual life, and what type of energy we're going to have now that we made it past those old hurdles. But that's all I want to talk about today. You have the strength to make it past whatever broke you in the past. You're stronger than that. You're better than that. You're wiser than that. And you have more spiritual strength in you than that. So let's finish the job together so we can see what's on the other side. Because I don't know about you, but I'm extremely curious. I just got to know. I can't live the rest of my life getting this opportunity and not know. I didn't come this far to turn back and be like, you know what? Nah, I don't want to know. I just want to leave it as a mystery, not me. I'm too curious. I'm too nosy. I got to know. I've been putting in too much work not to. So I'm just curious and excited about my future. Now that I done made it over my past hurdle, I want to see what's on the other side of that bridge, so to speak. But that's just me. That's just my intention. I don't know who need to hear it, but let's see what's on the other side. I know y'all just as excited as I am. Let's go. And I'm gonna be honest with you guys, man. I'm just, I'm doing this for me personally. I know I have my family and everything, and I know I have them to take care of, but I'm finally doing something for me. This is finally what I want to do for myself because I just want to know what's on the other side. I want to know personally what I am what I have to do to make it to the other side. I want to know what I've got to finish. What did I miss? I'm just doing this for my personal thing so I can personally rest because it's something that always bothered me in my mind when I was younger when I was in the position and I didn't finish. Now I got a chance to finish it. I have to see it through because I can't live with the regret anymore. I can't live not knowing what I could have had. And this is God's way of answering that challenge to me, letting me know, okay, you want to know what you had, what you would have had so bad? I'm going to put you back and I'm going to give you that opportunity. And now you're going to know what you would have had. So I want to know what I would have had. I want to know what I will have and what I'm going to have in the future. I'm just excited and I'm curious because, like I said, this is the redemption season. This is the get back season. This is the finishing season. This is the I'm too strong season. This is the I'm a, I'm a walking 99 season. This is the I'm finna finish what I started season. This is the ending better than we started season. So I'm back to finish what I started and finish the spiritual journey so we can reach our ultimate spiritual powers and we can reach our ultimate spiritual blessings together. So uh, I don't know about y'all, but I'm back to finish and finish strong. I'm back to make sure that the journey ends the way it was supposed to end the first time. And I'm back to make sure that there's never any question in my mind of what I can do or what I can't do. I want to know for certain what I can do. And I know what I can do. I can finish stronger than anybody else ever have. And I can finish my spiritual journey because I know I got the power. And I know you do too. And you have to speak and believe that with all your intention and go out and handle your business. Because I'm not going to live with that regret any longer in my life ever again. I don't know about you, but that's just my opinion on the situation. <laughs>